We have composed a little animation for you, showing the energy consumption of a standard building versus a hemp creek building. Both buildings are 200 square metre each. Let's have a look at the performance of both houses in cold conditions. Here, 6 degrees Celsius. Heating produced in the standard building is mostly absorbed by the walls. A large proportion of this heat will then radiate outward. This is due to drafts, lack of air tightness, thermal bridging and insufficient and effective insulation, costing you money. For instance, when the standard bulk insulation becomes moist, it will not perform as well as it should. On the other hand, a hempcrete building requires less heating to remain comfortable. Heating energy is stored by the walls and reflected back to the inside, not escaping outwards. This will lead to an energy saving of over half your bill. In hot conditions here at 38 degrees, standard buildings tend to heat up and have difficulty cooling down. Energy is required to cool the building. Due to poor performing insulation, a large proportion of the cooling will escape. On the other hand, hempcrete buildings provide excellent shelter against the outside climate, maintaining a comfortable constant temperature inside. There is little or no cooling required due to the humidity regulation of the walls. The hempcrete home will save up to 70% on your cooling costs. Now let's have a look at the results. We have researched worldwide household electricity prices. As you can see, Australian energy prices have increased over the last six years, and this is projected to continue. The environmental consequences of electricity generation becomes more evident on a daily basis. If we look at the breakdown of our energy consumption over a year, we use energy for our lights, cooking, fridges, computers, hot water, heating and cooling. Today, 60% of Australian homes are fitted with air conditioners. They are countable of 55% of the total energy bill. So if over one year, heating and cooling of a standard home cost the owner around $1,300, the hempcrete home will save the owner around $1,000. At last, let's have a look at the longevity of our homes. Standard homes are designed to last 50 years. But how does this work out in reality? According to the ABS, 11% of the dwellings needed repairs before they were 5 years old. 63% needed repairs once they were 60 years or over. Cracks in walls and floors appeared in a third of that 63%. Standard homes require continuous maintenance and are not designed to last. Over time, the hemp and lime will, will petrify. It will turn back to rock. The hempcrete home is lightweight and flexible, with good insulation that stands the test of time. We may conclude that an economic home low in maintenance and energy use that lasts longer is a valuable investment. Hempcrete walls are the best option for your future home.